But, uh, well, Tiger, he's going to run right up. He does not care at all. Zephyr still running, not really seeing Tiger. Now the toss back onto the Lion. It looks like we're going to see a very early first blood. He will try to earth spike his way out, but there is no way out. And to make matters worse, John, it goes to the pos one IO. So if you get unlucky up against Ayo, you just kind of, you got to kind of just give it up. You, you can't really contest. However, Koi for top lane. It's going to take a lot of damage, but he's going to give a lot back to Forev. Tiger going to chase him down, trying to get the self-cancellation. He does get it. Now onto Zephyr. They can kill the Lion. Very fine committed. Zephyr, Earth Spike will connect. Tiger has Avalanche. Doesn't really have enough for the toss, but it won't matter. He'll get the kill, and Forev, he cannot Ooh. trade. He's, he's still the king of this bot lane. Meanwhile, top lane, Koifa, he kills off Zephyr. And clears it out. Can't really punish it. Into the Mars, Carl. Avalanche toss from Tiger. It's not quite enough yet, but you've still got the IO going and chasing him down. And look how fast he runs. This is ridiculous. See, that shouldn't happen. How does the IO run that quick without boots? Tether. <laughs> Yeah, and look at this. On Wi -Fi. One. Look at the damage output. Just running down the Enigma. It's a double kill. It's in Soul Ring up. He can rip through. Foxy. Took it, got him. Shadow Dance already being committed. And there goes Insania with the Fade Bolt to help out. Like, Ags on 23 Savage again to leap out. We saw that before. It didn't work. No, it didn't. White Mon gonna die again. The Enigma. This Io just terrorizing T1. 23 Savage now, gonna be static linked up by Koifa. Stun will come in, it's not gonna be long enough. The link's still going. Savage is forced to shadow down to try and find a way out. He's gonna pounce towards the north. Meanwhile, for Rev, they're just gonna ignore him. They want the big one and they get him. Koifa just has so much damage. There was no TP cancellation necessary. He just hit the Slark once. Onto the Rubik. They do find Insania. They get something for their trouble. It's just not going to be anywhere near worth it. It's Tiger and Mickey moving forward again. Oh Toss God. in onto the Hellbear Smasher. It's considering his lane, but it still isn't a great showing. They're just being run down. At the position of Liquid, they're just ready to keep fighting. 23 Savage, again going to be chased down by Koifa, just all alone is going to die in the tree line. Carl looks like he just wants the power in it anyway. But the chase is on now, they're going to punish him for this. The Chakra does fly out, Tiger is there with the Avalanche to slow down Carl, and he's just surrounded. He's going to try and drop the arena defensively, it's not going to be enough. And the toss out right back onto Zephyr. Liquid, they are making this look a little bit too easy. Liquid will continue dominating this map. Mid lane, Insania gets the lift off onto 23 Savage, making him well aware that there is nowhere for him to farm. In fact, he's dead. Oh god. Tiger found him. He he just dies, the tiny. Radiance top tower has fallen. Just moving yep. in now. Behind the tier 2 mid tower. Carl, he's gonna look for a way to back off. Liquid are waiting. Tiger has the toss ready. Avalanche gonna be rather, yeah, it is gonna be committed, but the arena was there from Carl defensively. It's just not gonna be enough. Black oh. hole, it's gonna be cancelled. Insania had the spear, cancels the black hole. Now they're diving the tier 3 towers. We're 15 minutes into the game. Oh my They've cleaned God. them up. The oh goodness. Oh, they actually do give it to Savage. So they believe in the pounces. Savage can actually get out a lot easier now from these fights. So it's going to be a harder target to lock in. Avalanche, toss, Tiger, kills off White Mon, there goes Zephyr. <laughs> it, it just happens so quick. And perhaps they can find some solo pickoffs if they can commit all those spell taps. Here we go again, Boxy right in onto Forev, White Mon, just the damage coming up from these spirits, oh. they are getting shredded. Middle top tower. One more kill, yes. T1, can they find it? 
They, they've got to find at shot. least one. Who are they gonna kill? I don't know. I don't know. The Rubik maybe. Oh, oh my god. Look at her. Oh, maybe this is it. 23 Savage moving in with the Dark Pack. There's your arena down. They've got Tiger stunned up. The Perma stunned. The Earth like the finger. They get the 3 2 2. Uh, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. We've done it. We have done it. <laughs> oh boy. They needed that kill. Very important kill. It is on a support tiny. Whether or not it feels like it, and they're coming back in. Yeah, they are, John. White one gonna die. Barev, lift it up, does get the chemical rage off. It's just not gonna matter. Huh? They go for the bounty. Earth Spike not gonna land. He knew they were there. Plasma Field out, slowing down Zephyr. It's not like T1 aren't trying, they're trying to find a way back into this game, but Liquid just reading all the moves they're trying to make. Onto Forever now they go. They'll find another. Godlike now for Mickey. The Razor, they're gonna be really durable. Even the tiny Tiger is not gonna be easy as well. So the softest target is the Rubik. They do catch him. Onto the high ground they go, Liquid. Rev. He's gonna try and stop this. He might just stun himself here. And that may mean his death. As the plasma field comes in, Boxy won't go too much further. Savage in the back lines. Pounces onto the tiny. Now a black hole. White one is gonna get cancelled. The avalanche there from Tiger just in case. Carl now gonna move in with the arena right onto the IO. That's the one they want dead. But can they get through the raw HP pool? Not quite. Not when he's got a heart to ask up. Carl has been tossed back. Savage dying a boxy on the timber. Carl's still not dead but will eventually die. Onto Zephyr they go. They'll find the fourth. Radiance top tower. Got 3.6k HP, and Pounce is going to be off the mark. They will at least minus the Dominated Creep, but that won't really matter, because now Savage has been lifted up into the Avalanche Toss. <laughs> You're controlled solely down to Arena. Carl is going to have to land a big one on a key target. None of them are squishy enough to burn off. Barev just deleted by Boxy. I got right back in looking for a toss. Doesn't quite find one. That'll be Liquid going for the mid racks now. On the brighter side for T1, John, there is still T2 top tower, top tower available. It may not matter, it's Carl now being dived underneath the tier fours. Does die. Savage gonna try and fight another time. Straight pounce onto Insania, but that's it, they call it. They have had enough. Liquid, a very dominant game one victory. 31k net worth lead right at the end of this game. The team one, it, it doesn't look like it's gonna get any easier. He's uh, about half the CS of Mickey, and just look at the aggression right behind the T1 tower. All about, Fairy Fire has been eaten by Carl, but the puck is not done. He still wants to go for this. A salve out from Carl now, gonna be cancelled, and he gets the kill. Oh boy. Ah, oh, how'd he miss his uh, first stone here, though? It was right it, there. It can be a little bit clunky, Jonathan. Oh. Dreamcore committed, the Viper gonna get kicked out, it doesn't matter. They get the kill anyway, but now Forem's gonna charge in. But not for long. He doesn't want to die for T1. In fact, Mickey gonna turn right back around onto Zephyr. Tiger doesn't want this Diabolic Edict damage, but he wants to roll back in to try and help secure the kill. Zephyr, very fire. Splitter not gonna land though. White Mon now gonna rotate in as well. Has the Hex out and should be able to at least secure the Earth Spirit. And does. Carl hasn't really spotted him either. Rotations in. Insani are going to join in now as they commit the Dream Coil. The Coil was already broken as well by the Viper. And that'll be Carl dead. They don't manage to find it. They do try to rotate Bond. Boxy's out of mana, but also level 5. So it's hard to pierce through in Savage. I mean, Savage might die. White Mon might die as well. Bits of good news for T1 to hold up against. The towers are also still standing. You haven't had the opportunity on Liquid to really apply some push. And the charge in. 
Not gonna connect. Dream Coil is gonna be out from Mickey. Roll, not gonna be there from Tiger. Still, the damage is just insane. Hex out. They wanna try and turn back around onto this puck, but you've got the Fates Edict blocking out so much damage. It's just buying more time for this puck to get out. T1 are just playing around with so much magic damage that Oracle messes it up so badly. They need to catch the Oracle out first, and they might here. They may. Hex is there. White Mon, not level 6 yet. They do land the Split Earth. He has Fates Edict to use on himself, and he will. He'll be fine. Carl cannot secure the kill onto Insania. Now the roll back in from Tiger. Mickey actually kills off Zephyr. The Viper now taking way too much damage. The charge in from 4F, trying to go in onto the Oracle, trying to at least get this pass 5. But now the Fortune Zen's going to fly out. Forever not feeling too safe anymore either. Might just be chased down. Tiger doesn't connect the roll, but it may not matter. They have the boulder smash. They'll have enough damage with the right click of the puck. And while this is happening, Koipka is just allowed to AFK farm the jungle. So armlet up, two gauntlets of strength up. He is very tanky and they do make a move. Mid lane, Carl again being coiled. They won't kill him this time though. Tiger, he's going to be just charged on by Ferev. They get the Viper strike. Insania can't save. Still, they're gonna move in more. Foxy going after Carl. Meanwhile, Quaver joining his team for the first time. Straight onto the Spirit Breaker. Forever's trying to run, but the damage output looking a little bit too high. And Insania, with the Purifying Flames, does get the kill. Tiger's already set up, ready to go whenever. Boulder Smash, not gonna land. Charge in onto Insania. They want that Oracle dead. The finger out immediately, and they will get him. A great start for T1 as now they move into the Earth Spirit. Tiger, he'll magnetize, try to run the other way, but it won't work out. They'll get a second, but now Quaper's here. How do you deal with the Husker? They lose Zephyr. Forever, he's still trying, but it's not looking great. Or maybe it is Quaper. He goes down. Maybe they find even more as Carl could keep going on to Boxy, but the fear of the puck is there and he's right to be afraid. Mickey is back. That means Carl is gonna die. So while they did get a couple kill for them, kills for themselves, this is the best news you could hope for. Liquid, however, can get started on the Roche, and Koifka with a Oracle around can't actually heal up through it. Koifka, go for the life break. False Promise gonna be there, they stun him up, they wanna control this Husker as best as possible and just don't let him do anything. The only problem is, you've got Mickey there that's doing everything for him. Koipa, he's back up and healthy. Dream Coil's gonna be committed for the first time now, onto the breaker. Forever, he's just gonna die and Carl, he's not gonna be safe either. Savage? We're gonna go after the Morphling now and Savage, he needs to help his team but he just can't. They're actually going to move up top lane towards Boxy. He's going to have some help coming in. They're going to charge Boxy. He's fine with this. He's just baiting for his team. Earth Spike out onto Insania, but the team fight started on the other side. They go on to Zephyr. Viper Strike out on Tiger. Now Quaper just jumps in, killing off the left track into Carl. The Viper, just not so tanky, will also die. Liquid is going to happily tank it. T1, they're trying to get the bottom T1. Forev, gets another strike off. They found the puck. That'll be a big one. A godlike streak going the way of Zephyr. Yeah, and because of that, they don't ne they don't even find the bot tier one chest yet. So if they're not able to clean up that objective, oh, oh, the TP. It didn't make it in time. Carl, he knows he's dead. No way out of this one. Just sits there and takes it. Take him out. Then the Morphling can maybe get some more space out. Tiger over. jumps in with the Magnetize and Boulder Smash. But the charge is there from Ferev. Right onto the Earth Spirit. So here comes Boxy. And he has a lot of damage output on this Timber right now. White Mon is going to die to Insania. Meanwhile to the north. He wants got to be cautious about that item timing on the Husker here. Forever charge, gonna be out onto Boxy, it's a hard target. Roll in, Tiger, he wants to initiate, and they do go straight onto Carl again, the Viper in danger, but here comes Savage, he is just not gonna last, Koifa, he blew him up. Carl's gone, Koifa's looking for another target, 
Roll in from Tiger, trying to find that target. They have found White Mon out. It'll be another dead lion. That Mickey's not done. On to Ferev now. Maybe he could get the kill with these stuns out, but the silence there. Mickey is typing for this. <laughs> give his life away for it. But Witter without that shotgun. That there is, John. That there is. Right, anyway, Boxy gonna be targeted now. Earth Spike out onto the Timbersaw, into the charge. But here comes the rest of the team. Tiger, a great magnetize to start off. It's the Chakram. Whiteman's gone. Ferev, he's been rooted in place. He gets deleted as well. In fact, everybody is just dying. Only Zep is alive. But it's a pretty obvious play from Liquid here, just fading out with Koipa. Yeah, Boxy, forward, onto Carl. Get you stop. Charge in. Oh. Yeah. Charge is cancelled and now they jump in Mickey. Just deletes forever again. On to Whitemon. That'll be another. And there's Zephyr. He tried. He really did. But they're just going into their deaths right now. Carl, Dream Court up. Gonna be kicked back the other way. Savage. He just has to look to the fountain at this point. GG's called. He won. They've had enough and Liquid. They will go undefeated today, Jonathan. Very dominant stuff from the side of Team Liquid. Oh, yeah. They're looking good. They look going to the wild cards tomorrow. Yeah.